poet once said that children are messengers that we send into the future to a world we ourselves may never see. What sort of message shall we send? So don't look at this as a hundred thousand or whatever it may be. Look at it as investing in kids and the return will come back over and over and over again. And for that, I wanted to be here to say thank you. You know, we've known to become, that you've become the beloved leader of the Blue Triangle, uh, the one who has worked so hard to uh, see this place not just stay open, but become a bigger and better resource and space for this community. So I'm going to ask you what this means to you. Without investing in our children, we cannot expect the world to be any different than it is today. Today, we have committed ourselves as Blue Triangle friends and co-owners to do our very best for our citizens whose lives we touch. Thank you for being there to help my dream come true and to enable the coming generations whose feet hit this floor will feel your consideration and encouragement. Welcome one, welcome all to this fervor for basketball four-time host of the Final Four, that's Houston, y'all. If anyone doubts, let them know what we do it for. And with the power invested in the Blue Triangle, the future is anything but final for the generations to come. Thank you very much. So we'd like to present this plaque to the Blue Triangle. Um, the refurbishment is made to the Blue Triangle Community Center, a community pillar in the city of Houston. We're dedicated to the facility by the NCA Houston Local Organizing Committee and the NCA Corporate Partner Degree Deodorant on Tuesday, March 28, 2023. As part of this 2023 Men's Final Four, the NCA, HLOC, and Degree Deodorant are proud to provide this legacy for others to enjoy long after the championship ends. Degree Deodorant believes in the power of movement to transform lives and is committed to improving access to spaces for physical activity in communities across America. By refurbishing and restoring this gymnasium, the Great Deodorant hopes to inspire the members of this recreation center to move beyond their limits. And we'd just like to give a special uh, thanks to the staff at the Blue Triangle and everybody who's involved in this project. So thank you very much. This beautiful gym, releasing all the good wishes, prayers, and hopes for every person who enters, that this space will continue to be a light in the community where lives are continually changed and enriched. So I invite you now to cut the ribbon. One, two, three. The Blue Triangle as part of the Legacy Project presented by Degree is officially open. My name is William Johnson and I'm from Blackfoot Elementary. Right here, where I'm at right now, I had so much fun. It was just so much celebration. I was playing with the TSU basketball players and March Madness, and I just had extraordinary fun, like it was so fun. My name is Trendon Johnson. My school is Blackshire Elementary, and I've had very much fun today. I got to play with the TSU basketball players. I've never even thought that I would actually play with actual basketball players that actually play in the NBA. Like, yeah, fun. My name is Atiris Malti, freshman shooting guard from Texas Southern Men's Basketball. Today, I, I really, you know, I enjoy playing with the kids talking to them, you know, motivating them, giving them a little inspiration. I think, uh, like, with, with, with people like that in your life, even if me for a child, I, that helped me a lot. And I appreciate that. So I feel like me being able to do that for them or for younger children, it'll be a help. Hi, my name is Ariana Lee. I'm the Houston Youth Poet Laureate. And it means a lot for me to be a part of this dedication today because I was born and raised in Houston and it's so great to see other organizations recognize this community and to invest back in this community. My name is Cineria Ordonez and I am the External Affairs Market Manager for South Texas and the National Hispanic Business Development Manager at Comerica Bank. After many years of partnerships with Blue Triangle, we are excited for today's event. Seeing the partnership, seeing the community come alive, and knowing that there is a center for our third ward, 
This is a unique experience, and this is how, in Comerica, we are raising expectations in the communities that we serve. And we are proud to be one of the community partners and continue to do the work. Hello, Roderick Brown with UPS, District Health and Safety Manager, as well as our Community Relations Manager. You know, to see this day come true, I mean, it's just, it's just amazing. I'm so excited to talk about just the, the footprint started back in 2017, where UPS walked through the facility where the floors were wet and muddy. To see us clean up and now to get to today where we have the finishing product, it's just amazing to look at the building, look at the changes that have occurred over the years. And to the ladies of Blue Triangle, it's just amazing to partner with you. It's amazing just to have the love that you show for this facility and this community. And for us to give that back is truly amazing. And the last piece for us, the icing on the cake, was the sign out front. Glad you ladies love it and we love to be a part of it. Thank you. I'm Dorita Hatchett, Senior Director of Community Relations for the Houston Local Organizing Committee. It's a little surreal to see it all come together. It's actually a little sad too, because you kind of know it's over and we've just been doing a lot to make this happen and um, just made great relationships with Miss Charlotte and Lucy and Gisette here. And it's almost been a daily conversation for this thing to happen. Um, wanting a level of excellence that they could be proud of, that they could say that we did what they needed, um, that we're gonna help them accomplish uh, a part of the vision that they have for this place in some way. And I think the fact that so many people came together to make so many things happen for this project, that it says speaks a lot to the support that they have in the community. And really it tells you that there's a great future ahead.